Welcome back, I'm your Gibbs, and we are playing Legend of Grimrock. We're about to go down to level 3, which is called the Pillars of Light. However, before I do that, what I wanted to do was show not only the map, but also the stats for our good friend here. There's your f there we go, statistics. So here are the statistics that we have so far. We have 9 secrets, 1 treasure, 0 notes... Which I find that interesting. I'm not sure how I'm going to find my own notes, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. One skull, two iron doors have been opened. So there you go. You can obviously have a look at all the other stats. Playtime is an hour and a half. Let's get rolling here. Um, we need to head downstairs. So let's go ahead and do that. Let me just... Uh, what the hell is going on here? I've got a few things active here because I know that I'm going to be experiencing some spider love at some point. I think it's down here. And I want to not die. Alright, so we are in this section here. We are solo. We have a single person here. Okay, so what do we have here? The, a lone pillar of light stands alone in the night. Shit. Wait, I have to go get torches, don't I? Crap. I don't have any torches. Well, that's not gonna work. <laughs> Crap. I need torches, everyone. Alright, well, let me just go quickly upstairs and go find some torches. Shoot. Completely forgot about that. Okay, let's go... Uh find as many torches as we can find. I think we need four. So we'll grab this one. It's one. You know what I should do while I'm up here? I was actually debating whether or not I should or not. The I left the bone amulet in here. Uh, when I was rendering level 2's videos, I'm like, oh, it's right at my feet. Crap. So I'm wondering if I should just go and get that. Uh, it was down here, I believe bone amulet so why don't we do that I think uh, if I can just remember how to get out of here this is not how I want to spend this video finding torches alright so I actually have technically enough torches and you know what guys I'm not going to bother to get the bone amulet because I know there's one later on uh, if you guys don't recall uh, both uh, Veronica and Bazam had bone amulets um, in the game, or in the, the last playthrough. So I feel pretty good leaving the one that's here. Obviously, if you guys want to go and grab that, it's in the area down here where there's a pressure plate. And the uh, legendary folks basically come out here and trap you. It's the area where it says no weapons allowed. That's where the bone amulet is. So if you really are a diehard and you really want to grab that and go ahead and run down there and grab it. I have already wasted three minutes here getting torches because I forgot about this. In fact, I think I'm going to need more torches. But we should be able to grab some. Hey, we're back, everyone. We're level three. <laughs> Shit, I just look at my load. Oh, man. It's these freaking torches. Okay, so here we go. And here we go. Beautiful. Okay, so... That's pretty good. Frost bombs. I, I have to carry these frost bombs because... They're a pretty good throwing item. Oh! 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 Hello! Hello, sunshine! Really? 18? Uh, maybe that's what this guy's for. Where is he? He's There's an archer in here somewhere. There he is. Shit. Okay. Uh, where... Oh! Now I'm really getting myself into a mess here. Shit. Okay, we're gonna actually use this. Beautiful. Come on, come on. 
I know, I know I'm being hit by the arrow. I meant to freeze him. God damn it. Shoot, shoot. Alright, let's just get him back here. There we go, beautiful. Uh, we need to cast light again. Uh, I think it was this one, wasn't it? Wait, light. Eight and five. So I have these written down here on a piece of paper. Okay, uh, you know what? We are going to do this, and then we're going to rest. I promised you guys that I would be attempting to find all of the secrets in this playthrough. Uh, if you guys do find that I've missed even one, let me know, because I'm recording this in uh, complete levels, so I can at least go back and, and try and salvage it as best I can. But I am trying to find as all, all of them, and I will keep track of it. I'll show you guys the stats at the end of every level, because I thought that was actually a really good idea. Okay, so here we go. We'll save the game here. One thing I was reading about in the forums is that they... They are working, uh, Almost Human is working on a patch, and one of the things they're going to add is the quick save, quick lo quick reload, or quick load, whatever you want to call it, plus a few other bugs that are going to be addressed, so that's kind of cool. Looking forward to that, because that would, I in fact, if they actually get it out before I finish this playthrough, there's a high probability that I will install it, because... I'm going to need it, folks. I'm going to need <laughs> that quick button to, to save and reload. Oh, come on. That was just fail. That was a nice crit, though. I've been reading some folks arguing about the fact that this game is um, too easy because of the 2x2. Two two. Yeah, that was actually a pretty good shot. The 2x2... Two Strafing, I guess you could say, or circle attacking, or whatever you want to call it. I don't know. I mean, I think early on, I, I, I don't disagree. But it, my first playthrough, it took me a long time to actually get the technique down. And even still, I'm, I think with a single character, it's not going to be easy. Uh, frost arrows, I don't know what I'm going to do with those. Okay, so let's not lose track of the fact that I need to find it stuff hidden in here. Oh, another one to use. Ugh. The other thing I have to figure out is what magic I'm going to use, or even if I should use any at all. So consider this an invitation for you folks out there with any suggestions for how I should play uh, Two Room. I will listen, because like I said, I'm recording one level at a time. So there's an opportunity for you to impact the way I play the game. Uh, obviously this is not a blind playthrough, so there's really no spoilers to worry about. That would have been on the last playthrough. Uh, however, for the sake of other folks that maybe have stumbled in through here, let's try to keep it somewhat clean. Okay, here we go. So we have a key. Key. Uh... Oh, yeah, I remember you. The key's in here, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, let's go. That's what I thought. Hello, boys. Now. So let's see if we can do the dance here. Oh, that was a fail. Ouch. Not bad, not bad, not great though. Oh, I forgot about that pit. I nearly walked into the damn pit. Come over to this side. This is where all the cool kids hang out. There we go, beautiful. I really wish he would strike faster. Uh, God, I have to look at his ability to level that up. See if there's something else I can do to make him faster. Hello! Oh, how was that a miss? 
Early game. Oh shoot, okay, now I got two. Unfair, unfair. Nice crit though. Here, come over here. Daddy wants to show you a special move. Oh, hello, ladies. Lady. We don't even know what these are. Are they male or female? They're going to be dead in a minute. Oh, ho, 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 ho. you anger me. What is it? What is up with that? Why am I missing? Is that just a timing issue that I'm curious to hear what you guys think about that? I know there is a nuance to the combat, for sure. All right, any more in here? Yep, there is one more. Uh, let's see if we can get him to fall in here. Come on there, sunshine. That's what we wanted to see. Alright, so... We are looking for secrets and notes in here. Okay, there's a nice jar. What's that called? Cave nettle? Uh, we have a lever here. Aha, here's our brass key we want. Uh, shuriken I don't really use. Aha. This is just more of a back door than anything else. Uh, we might as well eat. Eat the heavier one. So, did I miss something here? So, we're here. Yep, 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 yep. I think there's a note in here. If I'm not mistaken. Uh, where the hell is the note? Do you guys see the note? I don't see you note. This is the right room, isn't it? <laughs> wow. I think I missed this note the first time, too. Well, we don't have all day, so let's just keep on moving on here. Maybe I'll make a trip through here on the way out. Some kind of. Not sure if I'm supposed to just click in here. I thought it would be visible. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe there is no note in here. Okay, so we have the key. We can now proceed to go through here. We should save the game though. We're actually on level 3-1. I know there's spiders in here somewhere. Do I have? I don't have any fire magic. No, just earth. So two spells. Uh, we have. What the heck was the next one here for this one? Earth poison bolt, which is I think like this. We'll try it next. Mm-hmm. So we are gonna need some torches eventually. <laughs> ah, hello there, my friend. Mr. Blue Crystal, which we don't really need. Do we? Not really. But you know what? It'll be good to save here anyways. Auto save. So there's the exit, folks. This is what we're pining for. And we're going to have to go the long way. Oh, you son of a... Oh, God. 
So I'm going to strafe this spider. As long as there's only one. So damn fast. Beautiful, that was actually pretty nice. I probably shouldn't have used that healing uh, crystal now that I think about it. Because I know there's another one in here. Oh shoot, it's dark now. Alright, well let's go over here in the glow. And we'll rest up here. We'll just get our mana back. Hmm. Oh, you know what? I actually think I remember now. Was it over here? No? I'm going insane. I know there's a note here somewhere. Okay, let's go. Any more spiders in here? Nope, not yet. Aha! Aha! <laughs> my favorite. Well, not necessarily my favorite, but God, I had, I had a lot of fun in here. A lot of fun. So much fun. Axe is actually doing not too bad. As long as I don't get poison, I'm okay. Oh, that was a fail. Oh. Beautiful. Well done. Whoa, I nearly fell in the hole here. So I do know there is a several secrets in here. I will come back to them. There is a secret wall here. There's also this timing one. Which is a whole lot of fun. Yep. And we have to fall down those holes too. But, let's do this one first. This was one of my favorites of all time. Uh, I think we need to do this. Ah! Oh crap! <laughs> That's not what I meant to do. God, I can't believe I'm failing this one again. Okay, so now we've got that center part in. We do need another stone. There we go. Beautiful. We'll open up the gate here and then we can go back and forth as we please. Uh, there is the iron door, which we will be opening at some point. And we have some nice poison bombs. I actually like this level a lot, even though it, I found it quite hard. I think it was mostly because of the spiders. But, um... I guess I'm better now? In theory? Maybe not? So yeah, so we need to unlock this. We uh, need a key here. A uh, key. I hear something. Yeah, there's spiders in there. Oh, no, right there. Holy crap, you scared the bejesus out of me. Oh, and I think the, one of the other things I noticed in the uh, patch notes is they've changed the interface to allow for it not to block. Like, I, I'm constantly fighting with the interface when I'm trying to open up those gates with the handles on them. But, anyways, I don't have the patch, obviously, just yet. Oh, we have a landfall here. Oh shit. Yeah, lots of spideys in there. We're not going to go in there just yet. Uh, oh, here we go. Beautiful. So this one here is... I demand a sacrifice. 
Put that here. Uh, we'll put some food on next. Secret found. So, here is our pants. Here is our mittens. And here is the iron key.